Hey guys, Dalton here with RV Wholesalers. Today we are going to walk through a 2024 Hampton 375 DBL awesome destination trailer here that is 41 feet 8 inches long, has a gross vehicle weight of 13,610 pounds, giving you a dry weight of 11,696 pounds, uh, which is a cargo capacity of 1,914 pounds. Um, this camper is has a freshwater capacity of 66 gallons, black water capacity of 39 gallons, and a gray water capacity of 78 gallons. Let's take a walk around this destination trailer that has a loft, um, awesome kitchen space, and uh, check out this beautiful park model. Hey guys, here we are outside of the 2024 Hampton 375 DBL. Of course, this is a park model, so it's not really designed to be towed all across the country and stop at every campground you see along the way more of your sit in one spot and enjoy it while you have a permanent spot camping. Anyway, here we are outside of it. You have two 30 pound propane tanks, manual uh, tongue jack here on the outside. But again, more designed to sit in one spot and camp while you have a permanent uh, camp spot. Anyway, the Hampton line here, you do have fiberglass outside, uh, aluminum walls on the inside here, and of course your foam block insulation. Uh, manual tongue jack or manual stabilizer jacks on the outside of this camper. Awesome setup. You do have yourself a 20 foot awning here, giving you lots of outside um, under awning campability here. And you do of course have your outside TV jack here. So that way if you wanna camp while you're outside here, you do have two outside speakers. And of course a place to mount your TV right outside the camper. Awesome little setup, love it. You, instead of having the big, nice big mole rides uh, flip downstairs, you do have two little, um, the old school springboard steps. Reason being, a lot of people like to put patios outside of their uh, destination trailers, and this still gives you the availability to fold these up. So in case you do move it and don't have a patio set up yet, you can still get in and out of your camper pretty easily. Of course, with RV wholesalers, we offer a Buckeye service guarantee. 10% off in the parts store if you're from Ohio, free Ohio delivery, and of course your camper's down for service. We can give you one of our uh, rentals so that way you can still enjoy your camping trip. Um, black glass, uh, tinted glass so that way your furniture doesn't uh, fade while you're going, uh, while your sunlight's beating down on the inside, and of course provide you a little uh, privacy so that way no one's peeking in on you. As we move back down the camper, of course you have your dog leash holder right there so that way you can tie your dog up on the camper. Don't have to go out and buy a tie out or anything like that. It's already provided with you with your camper. Um, of course, this is where your awning ends right here directly underneath the door. So as you move back down the camper, remember you're out underneath the elements. Being a rack and pinion style camper, you do have a manual backup here. So that way you can run these slides in and out if they do fail with the motors. Here we are at the back of the camper. Of course, you can follow us on any of our social media pages like Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, um, and of course, YouTube, just like you're watching currently. Um, right over here, of course, is your entry or your entrance for your power cord. 50 amp camper because you do have a 15,000 BTU air conditioner on the top. And of course, the second one back there that are ducted together and pumped throughout the entire camper is a 50 amp camper so that way you can power everything at once. Let's check out the other side. Here we are in the main components of your camper. Of course, you have your city water connection, fresh water connection, and of course your black tank flush. And of course, with it being a destination trailer, they actually give you a um, hose connection so that way you can run water off of your camper in case you need to uh, spray on your deck or do a little bit of cleaning. And of course, you do have a uh, hot water heater on this camper. It is a on-demand water heater so that way you have water right now if you need it. And of course, the one little bit of outside storage you do have is the back half of the king size bed. You do have access from it from the outside of your camper. It is not a magnetic hold, it is a manual hold, but it is very nice and easy to use. Just lift it right up, clicks right into place, and to release it, just reset it, release it out of there. And of course, they give you all of your irons that you use, tire irons, if you will, one to run down your jacks, and the other one to uh, run in your slides if you have to get them in and out if they get stuck. And of course, a nice little bag to keep them all in. But awesome little storage on the outside of the camper in case you need to put anything out here. Hey guys, here we are inside of the 2024 Hampton 375 DBL. 
in the very back of this camper, of course, is your kitchen slash living area. Um, in the very back, you have yourself a queen uh, hide a bed. Uh, of course, it starts off as a couch, and of course, you can fold it all the way out into a bed. Um, three different windows back here with entertainment center or entertainment stands on each side um, with plugs and uh, of course outlets on each side of it awesome view uh, outside of the back end of the camper and on each side with windows and of course nice big window of top overhead right over here we have your entertainment center with the tv that goes up and down just like the headlights on your 1978 trans am but awesome little pop up and down tv with your uh, electric fireplace underneath of there to keep you warm on those days where it's about 40 degrees out. Um, but of course, when it's negative two out like it is today, you're gonna need the furnace that's in this camper. Awesome black glass cabinetry directly above for all your DVD players or anything like that. Or if you're in the kitchen, directly beside there with your solid surface countertops, you can use that for canned goods or anything like that you need. Lots of counter space in here with the solid surface countertops so that way if you or cooking or prepared anything like that you actually nick it with a knife it's not supposed to leave any gouges or if you're cooking on this four burner cooktop here um, and you accidentally take your skillet directly on over to that uh, solid service countertop not going to leave any burn marks or anything but awesome 3.73 cubic inch uh, stove there uh, again with four burners on the top and of course a nice convection microwave directly above that being a destination trailer Awesome to have lots of cooking space and lots of area there. Lots of countertop or lots of cabinetry space all the way around your kitchen. And of course, lots of cabinetry space here in your island as well. Giving you lots of space to take all your cat, uh, kitchen utensils, frying pan, stuff like that. Continuing with your stainless steel appliances in this camper, you have yourself a nice Samsung dual opening door fridge. Uh, again, stainless steel with awesome ice uh, maker in the very bottom of this with lots of space. I think this one's even bigger than the one I have in my house, but awesome setup in here. And of course, you can set up all your drawers however you'd like there. Uh, but again, moving over to your pantry space, awesome pantry inside of this camper with the living edge there on the inside countertop, but awesome pantry inside of this camper. And it does come with a dual lock. So you can open both doors at once, but awesome size cabinetry, or excuse me, pantry in this camper, lots of space. And of course, with it being a loft, you can do get access to your loft directly above there, so that way your kiddos can watch you while you're sleeping, but do have access to your loft there while you're in your kitchen. Directly below that, next to your pantry, you do have a little coffee bar here for all your coffee goodies. And of course, a nice little place to put your coffee maker while you're cooking. And of course, a nice little cabinetry below, directly below. Rotating right across, you have yourself your uh, freestanding table and chair. Of course, you do have yourself your Kinex um, phone charger right there beside it. And of course, your table, it does it, it is bolted down, but it is freestanding. Uh, free standing. Nice little booth over here that you can store everything in, like your uh, blankets and stuff that you use with you to, on your uh, queen bed over here that your hide a bed and of course two chairs that move around while you're camping right over here you have yourself a heated and massaging power recliner um, I, I went ahead and activated the massaging there but of course it does recline and everything with just a press of a button and as you can see there is lighting underneath but awesome little theater power theater seating here by Thomas Payne uh, is an option for your camper let's go check out the uh, bathroom and the uh, front bedroom in the bathroom of this 375 DBL here, of course, with it being a bunkhouse, you do get a little bit of a bigger uh, bathroom. Porcelain toilet here on the right-hand side with a, lots of linen space with those cabinets for your tree bes right beside you. Do have a nice place to hang all of your uh, bathrobes and everything, of course. Nice full-size tile shower um, for you to be able to take nice luxurious showers in this camper while you're out camping. As you can see, there's your free starter kit that you get with every camper you purchase from RV Wholesalers. Awesome um, sink here with a vanity directly above it, so that way you can do your makeup while you're out uh, on date nights and everything. But awesome full-size bathroom here. Lots of space to move around. Awesome vanity with lots of space for medicine, toothbrushes, toothpaste, all that. But full-size bathroom here with plenty of space for one or two people to move around, so that way you're not feeling too cramped. 
As you move back from the bathroom towards the back bedroom, you do have a set of stairs to your left hand side that is all carpeted. Up directly above the back bedroom is the loft that I'm currently sitting in. You have two different mattresses here with a nice little entertainment center for a TV if you'd like to put one up here. Lots of space to move around. I'm 6'2", 300 pounds. And as you can see, plenty of space for myself and uh, another person. But you can use this as storage, sleeping area for kids or, any, or even adults. And then directly across from myself is another loft area which is directly beside the uh, kitchen area. Of course, a whole nother mattress that you can use for sleeping and or storage, but awesome loft area here in the 375 that you could use for storage and sleeping. And of course, you could put a TV up here if you, as well as you would like, but awesome little storage area and or sleeping area uh, to make your camper even more spacious. Here we are in the main bedroom of the three set Hampton 375 DBL. Of course, you have yourself a full size king bed being that it is the master bedroom. You want to have as much sleeping space as you can have in the inside of this camper. You do have USB charger on at least both sides of the bed here so that way you can charge your phone and everything while you're sleeping. Uh, you do have 110 put charger here on this entertainment center um, so that way you can put a TV up here um, so you can enjoy late night TV or watching the news while you're sleeping. Uh, directly beside me here, you do have, of course, lots of cabinetry space for all your linens, underwear, jeans, uh, Hawaiian shirts, so that way you can keep uh, uh, Jimmy Buffett's uh, Margaritaville spirit nice and alive here in the 2024 year. And, of course, directly beside that, just even more cabinetry space for all your stuff while you're camping. Of course, this king-size bed offers even more storage here because you can lift it directly up. And you do have, of course, a couple pistons there so that way you can access all the storage directly underneath there while you're camping. Being that this is a park model, of course, you want to be able to do laundry while you're camping. You want to swap me? Yeah, we'll come out yeah. Being that this is a park model, of course, you're going to have lots of uh, storage inside of here. So full-size mirrors so that way you can make sure you look nice and pretty when you go out. Um, so you can make sure your outfit looks nice and fly, but of course lots of storage in here with a full size closet, or if you want to put a washer and dryer, this is where it would go in your washer dryer prep closet. So washer and dryer in here, or of course just lots of storage space while you're camping. This has been, this has been the walkthrough of the 2024 Hampton 375 DBL. Hope to see you on the next one. Again, this is RV Wholesalers.